In this video, I want to introduce the concept of composite functions. So the word composite means to combine. So what we're doing is we're combining functions together, OK, in some way. So we might have two functions, f of x and uh, g of x, OK, for example then what I might want to do is I might want to put g of x into f of x. So I might want g of x being substituted into f. And this is a composite function. Now, as you might imagine, as I start substituting in more and more functions into one another, that I get more and more brackets, and it gets much more difficult to really figure out what's going on. So to shorthand this notation, we write this as f g of x. So this function, g of x, is getting substituted into f. Okay. So if I had g f of x, so f of x going into g, I would write it as g f of x. Okay. Now, as you can see from this, the order is to work from right to left, OK? So if I had another function, h of x, then if I had f g h of x, I need to know that h of x is going into g, and then that is going into f. So you work from right to left, OK, along the letters. Those of you who've worked with matrices will recognize this as how you multiply matrices together. OK? So working from right to left. Now, um, we could also put one function into itself. So we could have f of f of x. Now, it makes sense, given the notation that we've used, that we would write that as f f of x, which you can do. It also can be shorthanded to write it as f2 of x. Okay. Now, this notation, because it's, it's difficult with notation um, with functions, and there are some mixing up of meaning uh, that we need to be aware of. This doesn't mean squared in this case. Um, which is confusing because when we write sine squared, where it certainly does mean um, squaring, we write it as sine 2x, okay, where sine is the function. So really, these two things should mean the same, but they don't. Okay? Sine, cos, tan, the uh, trigonometric functions, uh, hyperbolic functions, those functions, they are separate from this. When you're writing it down in that format, it's taken to mean squared. In this case, however, this is a function of a function. Okay, so they have two different meanings, which is awkward, okay, and a little unfriendly. So, what we're going to be doing uh, in the next video is looking at an example of how we manipulate uh, these functions.